Another way of finding a combined price index when we have a lot of different items to combine is called the PASH index after another um, statistician. And this one is more up to date because it uses current quantities of items. The SPARES index uses the amount of items that were sold in year zero and it sticks with that. The SPARE looks at the quantities sold in the relevant years. So for example, to find the change from year zero to year one, let's look at the prices or the total costs in year zero but using quanti quantities of year one. So to compare year one with year zero we use the year one quantities. So we will get prices in year uh, zero times the quantities in year one. So that's 15 times 100 20 times 75 and 50 times 19 which is 950 and that gives us a total of 3950. So that's saying that when we're in year one if we think what the total cost of the basket would have been the previous years if they had bought the same number of items as they are currently buying. And we can now compare that with the prices, actual prices in year one times the quantities sold in year one. So now I get 16 times 100, 22 times 75, which is 1650 and 55 times 19 which is 1045 and if I add those up I get 4295 so that's the actual spend in year one year one quantities year one prices so we're then comparing that backwards with year zero, but computed for year zero using the quantities in our current year. So now if we call that 100, we get 4295 over 3950 times 100, and that comes out at 108.7, which is slightly different to when we did the same calculation with La Spare. With La Spare, we use quantities for year zero all the time. If I now wanted to do the same thing for year two compared with year zero, I'd have to use the quantities for year two times the prices for year zero, and then the quantities for year two times the prices for year two. So this method is more work because to do any particular year you've got to do more calculations with that year's quantities. With La Spare you're using those original quantities. But we might expect that this could be more accurate because we're using the latest figures for how much of each is bought. So again it's a swings and roundabouts. La Spare is simpler to work out but possibly slightly less accurate. This is more complicated, but uses more up-to-date figures. Okay, Mary, so let's have a look at this one. So solve x plus 2x equals 12. So what do you think you do first? Okay, well, I want x on its own, so I would put x equals 12 minus 2x. Okay, so a lot of the time we want to get x by itself, but what we want to do first is get all of these x's together. So can you see anything we can do with this? Get all these together in one place. Oh, okay, it's 3x, isn't it? Yeah, so absolutely. So 3x equals 12. Oh, and so x equals 4. Brilliant, spot on, well done.